एवरीबडी वॉच नेशनल जियोग्राफी की डिस्कवरी चाहना दे फील दैट अरे यार ये फील्ड में जाएंगे तो ऐसा नेशनल जियोग्राफी की डिस्कवरी जैसा रहता है लेकिन दैट इज नॉट द रियलिटी नो हियर द लाइफ इज रियली टफ आई बिलीव मी इट्स नॉट इजी when you talk about india there are more than 1000 different species of amphibians and reptiles in india you know and to identify them how many species are there is one it starts with that then how do they live what do they eat what is their behavior you know everything a study associated with that you know considers herpetology now i can't study herpetology uh, in a stand alone position no because as a frog it feeds on insects so i need to understand that insect as well frogs live in a particular habitat that habitat has particular amount of plants so everything is thus interconnected you know if herpetology is is dynamic in that way you know, and studying them is quite quite fascinating because we don't know anything i said there are thousand species of amphibians and reptiles in india but the knowledge associated with them is zero We have to do B.Sc. Then you have to do Masters. That is Masters, Masters in Science, M.Sc. or any biological science field. Then we have to do Ph.D. Then, is it necessary to do Ph.D. Bharat? Ah, uh, it is not necessary. But no, that is how the if you, if you think of career in herpetology, that's how the direction is. Right. Okay. No, no. So Ph.D. Then you need to do postdoctorates. then post doctorate then post doctorate and if you are lucky you get a job zoology is the is the if you want to pursue career in herpetology then zoology is must uh, i feel that national center for biological sciences and the wildlife institute of india these are the two places where they you know they are giving some uh, msc degree very nice professionally designed msc program is happening there and there are other places as well where like i i, I serves now all these icers no they have uh, integrated bsc and msc programs no all these places are really good you know so if i if you ask me to recommend something no these are the places but are these the only places i don't feel so no they make you a very good researcher but a normal university like shivaji university has created a herpetologist like varad varad giri that is also a reality you know there is another uh, young dynamic herpetologist in india his name is akshay khandekar now he is doing his you know work with thakre foundation he is from shivaji university you know so so i think education back background does shape your uh, you know education institutes does shape your career but what more an important aspect you know to make your career much more dynamic is your passion you know and how you pursue it i feel that if you have it you make it i like amphibians and reptiles to the core of my heart that liking should be there in all your acts we need to you know respect that animal first whatever that animal is if it is a bird or a snake or a lizard or whatever it may be we need to respect that first so if that respect is there you know if your fascination or love has this origin i think you can do wonders apart from that you need to have dreams you need to have big dreams you need to think big you need to think out of the box you should have out of the box ideas no you should read a lot you should understand a lot no you should be ready to live in hostile conditions you know studying amphibians is is a job of night you can't do that in the day no it's not like chalo are yaar koi researcher aa gaya frog aisa bolenge din mein ja ke call karte not they are working in the night we have to no correlate ourselves no or coexist with them no and to coexist we need to be like them you need to be open to ideas you need to be collaborative like if you ask me i feel that no many many times my collaborations help me to what i am today no i collaborated with multiple people and that that is something which is making me what i am today then work with your colleagues who are local field assets go to the forest no you we should be having 
uh, apathy towards them as well we need to respect them we need to work with them we need to you know if you are ready to spend time in the forest then all these things are needed uh, to become a good herpetologist prime challenge in this field is lack of funding because i'm not working on tigers <laughs> i'm working on lizards i'm working on frogs <laughs> so funding is a problem and without funds you can't do research without funds you can't sustain in this field so i was fortunate again i had backup of many of many friends but the major problem is funding no then second thing is getting job opportunity after no you complete your degrees and stuff like that but i always feel that no uh, if you have the ways and uh, no don't look at one goal if you have different goals i think uh, that may not be a problem no. so these are the issues then going out in the field no field conditions are really hostile no, because you don't have money so you have to travel in a small things you have to travel in a bus i traveled in the bus i did a marine turtle survey uh, throughout the coast of goa and maharashtra me and vitoba hegde we both traveled in the bus uh, uh, something around 1000 kilometers you know in the bus imagine carrying bags and going in the bus you know so we did that and today i'm tra- traveling in a big car so you no know, journey comes you no know, you get funding you have good car you don't have funding you have to ma- manage it so that's the issue then uh job is a problem as i said that you know wildlife is not at a popular kind of a field in this field, uh, in india but nowadays people uh, you know there are different opportunities which are popping up you know people are trying like when i started there was no option for me except working in some research institutes but today it is not the case you can join as a nature guide in some good resorts and get some highly paid job and stuff like that so you no know, there are uh, possibilities in that way but and then good mentorship is 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 also an issue you know uh, you need to work with good mentors good people all that stuff so these are some of the challenges which are there